Welcome to week two. So the big focus of week two is finishing up chapter three and preparing for our first test. So chapter three has a good bit more Excel. Definitely work along with my Excel videos that are posted in Blackboard to see what we're doing. And then try to get the new material covered as quickly as you can so you can start focusing on studying for test one. Unfortunately, or fortunately, the only way to study for a test, especially in a math class, is to do a lot of practice. It's one thing to sit back and watch me do math, but that's not really going to help you get any better at doing it yourself. So you need to take some time, put all your resources away, and try to work through the practice problems without any outside help to see if you can do it. And remember, you do get a four by six inch index card that you can use on the test with anything that you want handwritten on the front and the back. So if I were you, I would use that card to write examples and Excel directions and anything else that you realize is giving you a little bit of trouble as you're going through the practice. But the goal will be to do all of the practice problems at least three times all the way through to make sure that you've got it. Doing it once isn't enough. You've got to do it multiple times for the synapses in your brain to form really good connections and to make sure that you have mastered the material. So as you're working this week, please post questions on collaboration and feel free to stop by the office if you have any questions.